Oh, there it is. I just no scoped a guy all the way across the map. I got diamond, dude. <laughs> That's pretty sick. All right. Okay. What is up, people? Today, we're just gonna be talking. As you can see, and by what I would assume I put at the start of the video, here we are, like. <laughs> Three or four weeks later and I finally got diamond for my snipers. As weird of a transition as it is, this camo is going to kind of, you know, it's kind of something I want to talk about. I've been wanting to talk about it since this game came out. Um, wow. 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 Move on. So I'm sure most of you guys have probably noticed that since this game came out, um, I haven't really done a whole lot of trick shotting. I guess realistically, if you're asking what that has to do with diamond camo, um, for those of you guys that watched me back when Black Ops 3 was kind of new, I went for the Dark Matter camo, and I, you know, I ended up getting it. It took me like 10 days or something to get it. And if you remember, the way I unlocked it was I like hit a trick shot for Dark Matter. I don't know, if I remember to, I'll probably show a clip of it, but basically there was an assault rifle that was, um, you know, it was a single fire shot thing. It was, you know, semi-auto rifle. What, what is happening back there? Why, why are there two people just huddled up? Yes, dude! I fucking hit a nice shot! Let's go! Let's fucking go. He was kind of close, dude. There it is. That is Dark Matter. Completed, boys. With a trick shot to do it. <sighs> that guy almost just hit a quad. Oh my god. Yeah, I guess another thing, uh, you know, alongside my diamond camo. I finally hit third prestige, if I can ever figure out how to actually get there. Yeah, okay, I, I, it's on the right side there. It's, I finally hit third prestige, which, you know, people are already freaking 10th now, but... But the way I actually got Dark Matter camo was I pretty much just played nothing but um, hardcore free-for-all for like... Um, like two weeks almost. It was like 10 days, I think, from start to finish, and I played it a lot. But all I did was play hardcore free-for-all, so I got really good at hardcore free-for-all. And I was like, you know what? I'm pretty good at this game. I'm gonna hit a trick shot to get the biggest camo in the game. So one of the challenges was to get a kill, you know, get like, it was like 50 or 100 or something with this gun and have like five attachments equipped on it, which you had to use like special perks and stuff to do. So I got one away from that and I just went into hardcore free for all and I just, you know, I saved it for the last kill and I just did a trick shot with it. You know, I thought that was a pretty fun thing to do. Um, you know, I figured, I'd do it again for future CODs and stuff, but I knew that I didn't really want the camo on this game because it it really doesn't look all that good. It's a pretty plain camo. I guess if you want to see the camo, um, Jev, Phase Jev, he actually got it. I guess it's been glitched for a while and you, it was like unobtainable. I guess one of the rockets or something was messed up, but um, you can probably, it's his, he probably has a video on it by the time I'm making this video. In my honest opinion, I kind of actually think that the, uh, diamond camo is better than the big camo. The big camo is called chrome. I've mentioned it before in a video, but I don't know. I'm gonna guess most people don't know, but it is called chrome and it just, I mean, it looks just like it makes your gun silver. But I still wanted to do something kind of cool because, you know, I mean, it, it only took me like a day to get diamond pretty much done on all the snipers, or I mean gold done on all the snipers, which in turn is diamond on all the snipers. But one of the challenges is to use a division that's not, basically, don't use the class that's good for sniping and you have to get like 50 kills or something with it. So I did that on my Springfield and I got 49 and I've had it at 49 for probably like a week and a half, two weeks now. And in the last, you know, almost two weeks or however long it's been, I've been playing a fair bit of free-for-all. Not really a ton, but, you know, enough. And I've been trying to hit a trick shot for the last kill because I figured, you know, I did it before and it was fun. Why not try it again? And in two weeks, I have not hit a trick shot in free-for-all. Oh my god, they updated this stupid menu at the start and I keep backing out of lobbies and I just hit A instantly because that's where it used to be to find a match and I keep going into this stupid headquarters thing. Oh my gosh. And it takes like two minutes because it's actually searching for a game because they finally fixed the headquarters and that's those are big quotations there. They say they fixed it, but it takes ten minutes because it's searching like it's a normal freaking game. And so for people like me that are stupid and accidentally click on it, it takes so long. 
Alright, so now that we're finally in and probably not going to spawn in this round, you know, we're going to do some hardcore search and destroy. We're going to see if we can hit some trick shots with the M1 Garand playing by myself. Really? I'm not going to spawn in. Come on, let me spawn in. I'll be the last one. No! This game is so bad, okay? The headquarters thing is one thing. I just missed an entire round of search because the game just doesn't load you in. And, okay, now it would have spawned me in. Nice. Right on. Yup, you know we clutch in for my team. They're happy, dude. This really guy said right on. Him. Really showed really him. Really showed him. Yup. Yep. Thing or two. Yup, thank you. Thank you. I will be honest, I do like trick trying on this game. Um, the other day I played Search and Destroy for like an hour or two, and you know, I had fun playing it. Like, it's not like it's not a good time. It's just that Search and Destroy is never a consistent way of like, you know, someone who does YouTube, it's not a consistent way to get clips because you're not constantly hitting trick shots, you know? <laughs> well, I should have just, I should have gone for a trick shot, but I was just like, I think it was still kill one when I started, so I just started hip firing at him. That's how you win the game, baby. Easy. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Gosh, I was just... I was editing this video, I don't think there will be a kill cam for this, but... I was editing this video and I felt like it'd be wrong to talk about trick shot and, and not have a trick shot. Just ignore the fact that they got 600 points. It didn't take me that long, you know? Um, yeah, it's not gonna be a kill cam, but... You know, I just wanna, I just wanna throw a, a trick shot in here real quick, you know? I don't even know, this video didn't really even have anything uh, all that interesting in it, but, you know, I just gotta wanna let you guys know that... Um, you know, trick shot and it'll come back eventually. It's just, I don't really have, you know, a whole lot of free time to be trick shotting and stuff. Honestly, playing Hardcore Search for like half an hour, that was actually kind of fun. Um, there were some nerds, don't get me wrong, there were some nerds, but, uh, it was, it was pretty fun actually, and I was playing by myself, so. You know, may have to do some, uh, search videos here shortly coming up, but I guess I'll see you guys, uh, tomorrow with another video. You know, send in your clips for the top plays and all that stuff. That's probably what tomorrow's video will be. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys then. Have a great day, everybody.